Hey guys, welcome back today. We're doing a one OCP build for the Aimbolt Ranger. This is off the back of our Black Eagle Ring um, showcase from, I believe, a week ago when this video comes out. Um, technically, it's not an OCP, but, you know. Um, first of all, Circle of Time for Ranger, Aimbolt damage. Get um, Strat Jewel 3 to combos with the Black Eagle Ring, which is actually a Kachua, not an OCP and uh, Master Archer and the Disguiser card for extra long range damage. Now the single OCP or technically a Kachua item is a Black Eagle Ring, a ton of attack, but um, you know obviously we get the combo with the Strength Jewel 3 which is a 0.5 second FCT reduction as well as additional 20% in bolt damage per two refines. And we have the Gold Scarabba card here just to maximize the additional 20 attack. You know, just to give you that force pump. Next, we have the Grace Aim Suit. I've been waiting years to actually use this. Combos with uh, all the Grace stuff, aim bolt damage, Porcello card. Obviously, combo with the white Porcello card on the boots. Speaking of the boots, 0 0.5 second FCT reduction, which covers our 1 second FCT. Um, and the white Porcello card for additional 10, I'm sorry, 20 attack. Um, next, the Grace Attack Mantu, you know. 10% size damage, can't go wrong with that for a free item. You got the Men Black card here for the additional long range damage. Um, you, know, you could probably use Empathizer card if you can afford it. And the Grace uh, Attack Ring, um, the VCT reduction, as well as the Gold Scarab card again. Although you don't really need a lot of VCT because the Black Eagle Ring combo reduces VCT by 100%. Next, the uh, um, Awakened uh, Scarlet Dragon Bow. A lot of aim bolt damage, cooldown reduction, obviously, that's the most important thing. Got the Re Resentful Soldier card for 20% long range damage, and the um, Archer Skeleton card for 10%, plus the combo, obviously, for additional attack speed, which normally doesn't matter, but, you know, still works. So let's do a damage test with the Oreticon arrow. First, the large and then medium, because again, 75% damage to large on both, and 100% for medium. 4.7 million. This is a lot better than our last test. 5.1. Yeah, spammable too. Well, a little bit. May need a little bit more ECD reduction. Alright, next, the Undead Dummy. Obviously, we are going to run the Holy Arrow to maximize the elemental damage. Seven million. I mean, to be fair, we were doing about 250 million with a full set, but uh, seven million for this isn't bad, especially with a gray set. All right, guys, so that is it for our uh, all the one OCP build for the Aim Bolt Ranger. And um, to be fair, the gray set actually does hold up and synergizes nicely with the Black Eagle Ring combo and the um, Temple Circlet. Um, needs a little bit of work on ACD reduction because, you know, obviously with the no OCP builds, ACD is most of the time the issue. But um, at least we got the FCT and then the VCT sorted. So, you know, that's most of the job done. Um, I'd like to point out that the Black Eagle Ring is not an OCP for you people over there who are just waiting to comment that, Oh, no, no, no. Black Eagle Ring isn't an OCP. It's a Kachuaki something. But it is a Kachuaki, and I will have that on the description below. So don't get too technical because, you know, I, the, I use the word OCP universally for non-F2P stuff. All right. But um, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys next time.